with something and they start losing. Trump bombed solitary tonight. And hopefully it'll do good. We'll take care of his flames for a while. Won't be left no staring gas against nobody. It's a shame. That Russia puts up with this son of a bitch. Bashar al Assad is a war criminal. Nothing but, nothing but, nothing other than a stinking, low down war criminal. And I don't care who likes him. He's a stinking, rotten, bastard war criminal. So those guys have sick picking. This guy has butchered and murdered more fucking people than I can count. That's wrong. It's wrong. What the U.S. did tonight is right. Can't be using sarin gas against your own people. We won't allow him to use sarin gas against people. Just won't happen. I don't care if Russia likes it or not. Russia's got no business in worrying about it. I don't know what the tie is between Putin and Bashar al-Assad. Well, he's just as nuts as Bashar al-Assad is. I don't know which one it is. But Bashar al-Assad is a butcher. Should not be allowed in this country. In this country, the ruler. He cannot rule. He cannot dictate. He cannot live. That's the thing. Somebody needs to take this prick out. Somebody needs to take this prick out. And that would be the best option for the American people. Let's take an assault force and go into this guy's castle and take this son of a bitch down, period. And I'm hoping that's one of the next assignments, is to take Bashar al-Assad out of power. Because he's a butcher, he's an animal, and he's a crazy person. It's a shame. Mr. Assad, it's a sample of what you're going to get if you don't have any more gas. We're going to come in there and get you and rip you in half and sell you to the nearest demo. Zero's nearest meat factory. It's dead meat. It's a sun being human being stark loose. Mr. Assad needs to be gone. Mr. Assad needs to leave. I still got a chance to get out. Sunday to the big star comes. Thank you for watching.